Hello, everyone. I'm Hubie, here with my friend Carpenter Ed and several other of our friends of the Boys and Girls Club in Lake Helen. Today, we're going to do a really fun woodworking project that's going to help us get ready for Christmas. That's right, Hubie. Today, we're going to make our very own Christmas tree. Wow! A Christmas tree? That sounds awesome! Let's get started. First, you need a board about eight feet long. You're going to cut that board into sections, each section being slightly smaller than the section before it. Now, you always want an adult to use the power tool, so Ed is going to cut the board for us. After the board is cut, the next step is to arrange the pieces on top of each other with an inch of space in between each one. And you want to place the largest board at the bottom and the shortest one on top. And now, what you want to do is, starting from the top and working towards the bottom, is to draw the shape of your tree. Hey! I can see the shape of the tree now! That's right, Hubie. And what do you think the next step is? You have to cut it out! That's right, kids. But remember, you need an adult to do the actual cutting. The next step is you want to get a board, you can use your tree trunk. And then what you want to do is lay your piece of cut tree board on top of the tree trunk and space them out like you want. And now comes the really creative part. We get to paint it! And while the kids paint, I'm going to build a little tree stand so we can put our tree wherever we want to. It makes me happy to do something like this. It sure does. Woodworking is a great way to boost your mood. It feels great to do something creative. And we're not done yet. We have little hooks so that you can screw in and hang decorations. Wow, it looks awesome. And it didn't really take very long either. It's a simple project you can do in one afternoon. And you know what else? By simply varying the size of the boards, you can make a wide variety of trees. Remember, sometimes even a simple creative project can help to brighten your day and make you feel happy. And so, until next time, remember, a healthy me, a healthy you, being creative is the thing to do.